Okay, 2019 Hobie Outback on a 2020 load right trailer. Three sets of bunks so that I can carry one centered on the middle set. Or I can get my wife's compass and we can carry all, both of them on each side. They're 10 inches apart. It's with the 2 inch PVC gray in color. Uh, it's the gray conduit and it has a little more flex in it. I'm not sure if you can see this. I'm going to try to get up underneath. But the conduit does flex to the hull of the kayak this way. I've had no issues with it at all. Used it all summer. Set up. Got a little Garmin Striker 4. A couple rod holders. Yak Power Spotlight. Got the eight trail upgrades. Got a cup holder for my UE Boom. Got to have my music. Got to have some tunes. Got a cooler. This Walmart cooler fit perfectly. Opens up. I used a separate fish bag in it. Yak yeah, crate. On the back of the trailer, these are my guides to help get it in. Put the little 45 degree elbows. Just in case the ramp's not steep enough, I'll put some pool noodle there to stop it from bumping. On this side of the yak, got the anchor trolley, a couple cleats, my baler. You can see that I have the, the boondocks landing gear option. And I had to have, I had some three quarter inch spacers made. To accommodate that, I got the small tackle box, tackle bin there. There's that spacer. I had it made in CNC out of plastic so that it fit perfectly. Second rod holder in my center compartment. You see my Yak Power power switch. And up in the front, in front of the bucket, I have the Yak Power battery box. Any questions? I'd be glad to answer them, but I've had no problems with this setup at all. It's really easy to load and unload. The kayak just glides right up on those rails.